Welcome, Dovakins. What day is today? Hell yeah! It is Sunday, so welcome to the second episode of Best Mods Weekly for Skyrim and Skyrim Special Edition. The last week was absolutely glorious. So many awesome mods released, so let's go and see them. In this episode, let's start from Special Edition mods and check of some beautification project first. First one is CC HQ4 Dungard. Awesome Retecture mod for 4 Dungard. Despite Special Edition EMB doesn't have parallax, these textures are really insanely detailed. So besides great quality, there is a little 3D looking imitation. The Retectures also available in 4, 2 and 1K resolution. Unique locations – Riverwood Forest. It is a landscape overhaul for area around Riverwood. Zones between Riverwood and Helgen, Riverwood and Whiterun, and zone near Bleak Falls Barrow. Mod adds not just the trees, but also new hills, waterfalls, bridges and ruins, thousands of objects in total. If you want to add some beauty and logical details to Riverwood area, download this one for sure. And there are also compatibility patches for Alternate Start, and GK Riverwood in the file section.
Smart Equip. This mod idea is really unique and awesome, and it will save you a lot of time. It allows you to configure sets of clothes or armor and other items that will be automatically equipped based on the state of your surroundings. Currently, there are six conditions. Frostfall cold weather, when it is cold outside. Swimming, obviously. Dungeons, equip your best armor when you are ready for battle. Civilization, when in a city or around smaller settlements. Wilderness, any outdoor location that doesn't fall under any of those about conditions. And default, what you wear any other time of one of the above conditions is if made or not configured. And there is additional option for the items that should be geared always. The mod usage itself is simple as that. Just open the MCM menu, set the items you want for different conditions and exit mod menu. That's all, you're ready to go. Monster Eyes is a player eyes mod. It is small, but you may really like its original design. It adds 20 beast looking eyes, and moreover, these eyes are also adjusted for all other non beast races. Campsite It is a simple camping mod that is a great alternative to campfire. If you are not using Frostfall, so don't want such a big mod as Campfire for just a few basic camping features. It has no perk system and no other additional features. Just everything you need for immersive camping. If you have at least 3 firewoods in your inventory, just click on it to build a campfire. 3 firewood for small campfire and 5 for big one. You can also add a cooking pot to the campfire to always be able to cook some meal. Useful if you are running eye need or realistic needs and disease for example. And you can also add map marker to always see your campfire on the map. There are four types of tents, from the smaller to much bigger. When you place the tent, by activating it, you can switch between different options – sleeping, crafting or storage functionality. That's it, just the no-frills camping mod, immersive and stable. At the end of this list, I want to let you guys know about small patch mod that actually contains a lot of work. Skyrim Immersive Creatures Unofficial Patch. It is work in progress patch and it covers different errors in Immersive Creatures mod to prevent illogical moments and some crashes. That's all for now guys, thank you for watching. I hope this video was informative to you. Enjoy the new mods, stay tuned and see you next time.